<laughs> Hello everybody! Welcome back to some more Burnout 2, Point of Impact. Last time we did a pursuit, we did a sprint, and we did a face off. And we won those pretty easily. Although the oval racer did put up a fight, but in the end we did win. And now we got a 5 event Grand Prix to do, so we are gonna do that in this car. The classic. Pink! Ah, uh, you know what? Just to mix it up, let's go pink. <laughs> Alright. You're probably gonna say, why did you pick pink? You should have went with blue. <laughs> nah, I just wanted to use pink at least once. We're gonna use all the colors at least once. So, next time we use this color, I'll go with the light blue. Three, okay. Two, one, go. Ooh. That is a pretty nice jump on this car. It is a pretty quick car, but acceleration-wise, it is not as fast as the hot rod or the oval racer. But it is pretty good in speed, so that's good. And that car passed us. What a dick. Whoa, doggy. This snow track and the cones, it, it reminds me of the Alpine. I hate you. Okay? I hate you. It reminds me of the Alpine track in Burnout 3. Because it's a little similar layout, but it's not the exact same. I'm just saying, though. Oh, right. If you guys notice a bit of the graphic change here, I do have the M Classic connected again, but this time, I have the... Okay, when you use the M Classic, it has, it comes with a USB cord that is used to power on the device. And, apparently we're on our second lap now, and you can either plug the USB into the USB port for power, or the, with the power adapter, plug it into a wall outlet or something. And Wow! Wow, that, drew, that was a big class. But uh, anyway, I had it plugged into a power third bar for the outlet. And I think that's the reason why. I don't know if the M Classic comes with a power adapter. I don't know if it does, but if it does, then. I don't know, maybe it doesn't work as well in the wall outlet. So right now I have the USB plugged into the back of my computer. So hopefully now it's not going to affect anything. So, here's hoping. Woo, woo, whoa. That did actually help. Although it doesn't help when this stupid moron keeps passing me. You are not allowed to pass me, dude. Don't you know? You never pass a pink Cadillac. If you do, you will die. That's a true fact. Get your facts right. You pass a pink Cadillac. It ends for you. Your game is over. Although it's a little hard to keep up with the burnout in this area. Especially with there being a lot of semis around. Come on, Carl. Stop using the blinkers and actually move. Let's go. It's time to go, go, go. Don't you know it's time to go? You're in a race. It's no time to go on a cruise. If you're going on a cruise, then at least win the event. Whew. Okay. Not doing too bad right now, but I don't want to risk anything. We're on the fourth lap out of five. That guy could easily catch up, and I don't want him to do that. 
Don't honk on me. What did I ever do to you? Besides honk back at you. What are you gonna do about it, huh? Nothing. Cause you're way back there. Ow. Ow. 6.5 seconds ahead of second place. Okay. As long as I don't hit anything, I should be good. And I should beat the lap time. No, don't hit that guy. Okay, whoa. Too early of a ton. Come on. 3.7 seconds? Seriously, dude? He is catching up. I do not like that. Why does there have to be a lot of tight turns on this map? Woo! Alright, we got another... There we go. We got two straight burnout boost, so that's good. There we go. On to the second event. I didn't beat my fastest lap either. Wow. That blue car is in second. Dumbass. White car in third and that other car in last. Hmm. That blue car is my biggest competition. Even though he could be left in the dust. Welcome to Sunrise Valley Downtown. Hi, thank you. Thank you very much. Those are a little weird. Those... Two, one, the... The light rays going down from the light under the bridge almost to the road. That's a little weird, but all right. Hey, don't hit that gun. Also, we're in the downtown area at what looks to be sunset, and it's looking pretty good. I like how that there's different times of day in this one. I don't know if we have much of that in Bruno 3. I think this is the game that we have a lot of day, night, and rainy weather, even though it only rained once so far, but I like how there's a day and night system, so that's something at least. Maybe we do have, well, maybe we do have day and night in uh, Bono 3, I think we do. I just don't remember there being much of that, because it did seem to be more frequent in this game compared to 3, but... I don't know, I, I haven't played 3 in quite a while, and I had that Burnout 3 walk down, uh, walk, what? Walk down? What is a walk down? Walk through, a full walk through of Burnout 3 on my channel, in the form of uh, being a members only playthrough. So if you guys are interested in supporting the channel, you'll also have access to my full Burnout 3 takedown walkthrough that I did 100% on for the first time on the original Xbox that I, I did play Burnout 3 on the Xbox 360 when I had it so it does play pretty well on the Xbox 360 although for some reason Outlaw Golf 2 does not like being played on the Xbox 360 because it does have a lot of slowdown especially during the intro sequence but yeah, I don't know how this game plays on the 360, get out of my way, because I currently don't have a 360, believe it or not. My buddy bought my 360 off of me, because he needed a replacement for his 360 Elite that doesn't work, so he bought mine off me. And when I get a 360 down the road, it's going to be in the color that I want to get it in. Because I'm kind of a sucker for white um, game consoles. I have the white OLED Nintendo Switch. I have the 
while it's the switch itself with the OLED screen, that's not white, it's black, but the dock that you dock the switch in is white. The Joy-Cons are white, so there we go. The other white console I have... I don't, I don't even think I have another white console. What? What? Really, dude? It did it again. Wow. Smarten up, will ya? Come on, I'm classic. Get your head in the game. Woo. I do have a red watermelon N64. How did I even class though? That was more of a side swipe. A hard side swipe, but still, come on. And I didn't beat my previous laptop because of that. Wow. But yeah. Uh, red M64, white Nintendo Switch. I've got some colored controllers. I do have the blue and gold limited edition PlayStation 4. I do have a crystal limited edition original Xbox. But I'm not using that because... Yeah, I screwed it up. I do have a video on that as well. I got an error code 16 on that Crystal Xbox and I still haven't been able to fix it, so, yeah. Alright, what else? I have the red Nintendo Wii, the 25th anniversary Mario edition Nintendo Wii. The Wii U is the black one, not the white one, cause the black one you get a bigger internal storage capacity with it, so I got the black one instead of the white. Um, the new microphone I got that I'm using, the HyperX Quadcast microphone, is white. Um, Three, two, one, go. I think that's it for the colored consoles. So, there we go. But yeah, I do like the glossy white Xbox 360, so that I'll, that's what I'll be getting down the road. There was, there's also other variants of the Xbox 360, like the Halo, Gears of War, Modern Warfare 3. I did have that one a long time ago, but I don't anymore. And yeah, but... Even though the Star Wars one it has some white in it, with some blue things here and there, I like the fully glossy white version of the Xbox 360, so... Yeah, I don't know what it is about the white consoles. I don't know, I guess they just grab my attention more. Get out of my way, people! What is wrong with you guys? Don't you know, this is racial territory. Get out of the road, get out of the way if you want to live. My god. Get light. Okay. It looks like with the USB even plugged into the computer, <clears throat> the M Classic is still not doing what I want it to do. And what I want it to do is to stop producing a black screen on some occasions, but I guess if it's not directly plugged into the console or whatever device, then it's going to have a little hiccup here and there due to resolution changes and stuff like that. I did not hit him. Haha, <laughs> take that. Hey! You're not supposed to spawn him in front of me. Yeah, he crashed again. What an idiot. In the meantime, I avoid classes, so... Yeah, your, your imagination is running wild. I don't know how you think that I'm classing all the time, but I'm not. <laughs> Woo! Hey, there you go. I did not do that. Whoop! Ho ho ho! I did not... Okay, good. I'm 
come on. Give me boost. You know you want to. Don't hit me. Good. Nope. Ow. No. That was not my fault. He appeared in front of me. He cut me off. He did it. Okay, that was a little graphical glitch with the M Classic. I don't know. I hope the M Classic is not uh, having any issues. And the thing with the Bahai Bros Jadusha adapter, with the connector connecting into the Xbox, it doesn't look like it can fit in all the way. It doesn't. It only goes in a certain way, a certain length. It doesn't pick up the whole connector. So I think they made the connector a bit too long, but I don't know. I don't know if that has anything to do with the graphical stuff, with the M Classic, or whether the M Classic is just having a hiccupy day or whatever. Hopefully there's no issues going on. Because the M Classic is really, it's, it's really, the M Classic does make a difference. A noticeable difference and I don't have a spare one and even if I do I think it's gonna run into the same issue so I think it's just a matter of whether it's connected into an HDMI adapter or whether it's connected straight into the device so I think because I'm using an HDMI adapter, the Jadusha for the original Xbox, I think that's the reason why the M Classic is not uh, really focusing on keeping the image up all the time. I don't know. I'm not sure how it exactly works, but that's my theory on it. It'll work better. Seriously? You just had to do that when I'm about to win? Yep, I lost this one. Wait! For the first time, thanks for that stupid taxi, I got bronze. Wow. I didn't even do a perfect launch, so maybe that's partly the reason why. Yeah, let's go with that. I only got one point, really? <laughs> I'm still in the lead though, but... We got two more events. And it's already been almost 20 minutes, but... In the editing, I'll slink it down a bit. Hope you guys don't mind the different lunch with these videos. The Grand Prix does take a little while in one video, so that's why I'm saving the other events for their own videos, so... Three, two, one, That's why the... Sometimes they're a bit short in that regard, compared to the Grand Prix, so... Hope you guys don't mind that. And hopefully you guys can actually hear me and everything. I do the testing, and I'm actually using the one capture program. I use the... RE Central Able Media Capture Program to record the gameplay all the time. But seriously? Get out of my way. And I usually use OBS to record the microphone, but I'm using RE Central for the microphone for this playthrough. So hopefully all goes well with that. And because I'm using it with RE Central for recording the microphone, I'm able to 
make the recorded microphone file be separate than the game file so that way I can easily adjust the game volume and the microphone volume but also because I'm using RE Central to record the microphone as well I'm not I don't have to edit it in editing or syncing up the video and audio. So the gameplay and the microphone audio. I don't have to sync it up together because when I'm recording it straight from RE Central, they're already synced up together. They start at the same time in the separate videos, so I just have to just put them in the timeline in the editing program and boom, I'm good to go. With OBS, since I have to press record on that, when I hit record on the RE Central program for the gameplay, I can't, I can't hit record at the same exact time with both of them. So I try to sync it up a little bit by timing it. So I. I hit the microphone audio just after I hit the gameplay recording. So, you might not understand what I'm saying right now, but I'm just saying with OBS, I have to sync up the microphone and game audio every time in editing. Well, I was using the RE Central program for both gameplay and microphone. I don't have to sync it up. I can just put the videos in the timeline. And I'm good to go. They are catching up a little bit, but they're not going to pass me. Not this time. As long as the car actually doesn't crash. It is a long car, the, this car. And it can hit the corners easier than the shorter cars, so... Yeah, how about that? Come on, audio, don't glitch out on me. The end classic sometimes can be... Stupid! Don't let them catch up, come on. I don't want to get second again. At least don't let the blue car beat me. If the blue car beats me, I might be in trouble. So hopefully I can actually keep ahead of the blue car at least. Crashed after the finish line there. Okay, come on. Don't make the blue car be second. One more event to do in this video. Okay, good. The blue car was not in second. It was in third. And that other car at the bottom seems to suck for whatever reason. Don't know why, but he is. But that's not my concern. Okay, I think even if I get second and the blue card gets first, I'm still good. Because you get three points for first. I just can't come last. You get one point even for being in third. So even if the blue card wins and I get third, I'll have 11 points, he'll have 10, and I'm good. So, 
As long as I don't come last, I'm golden. Baby. Oh, I... Whoop, 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 up. Woo. Okay. I think we might have raced on all the tracks that this game offers. This game is not as big as Bruno 3, so it's not going to have as many tracks as 3 does, but... So there is going to be a few repeats here and there, but what can you do? I also don't know how long the championship mode is in Burnout 2, so if you guys know how long the championship mode is in this game, then let me know. But, uh, I don't know, since this is a smaller game than Burnout 3, Burnout 3 has 173 total events. I don't know why it's 173 instead of 175 or 170, but it's a lot. So this game, I think, might have maybe close to... I'm gonna take a guess here. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that the total number of events is going to be maybe... 80? I'm gonna say 80 for the total number of events. Unless Criterion likes going odd with the number. In which case, maybe 80... 7? I'm not sure, but we'll find out. Also, that was a pretty long lap. So we're gonna be here for a little time. We also had that little off-roading suction, so... That's interesting. But either way... We got a pretty decent lead on them, so... Whoa! Turn car! Woo! Hey! How dare you! Ow! Here we go. They are right there, so they're not that far behind, but... I... Whoa! I want to be farther ahead. Come on, game. Don't hit that guy. Don't get in front of me, people! Wow. Oh, nice. That was a good grip. Whoa, don't hit me. I didn't do anything to you. No, don't hit me. <laughs> Four. And then a stupid traffic cloud ruins everything. Wow. So sad. And they're right here. Of course they are. Even if the blue car wins, I'm not gonna lose. I have this thing in the bag. Ha ha. Woo. Nice. Whoa. Super close. I did not even 
hit that guy. I did a little side swipe, but nothing to do. Will you stop getting in my way, people? What is wrong with you? And he is getting close. I do not like that. Don't get in my way! <laughs> Stupid idiot. No. I don't want to be last. I don't want to tie him. Get back here. Get back here, douchebag. I got something to say to you. Look. Oh, I hate that blue car. That blue car can go suck it. You know? Yeah. All because of that stupid idiot that got in my way. I got two points, I'm still in the lead, so I got first place for the trophy, haha, <laughs> in your face, says. Okay, we unlocked the crystal freeway, a face-off race remains locked, a track remains locked. Oh, we still have another track we haven't done yet. And we have unlocked the crystal freeway, so that's, I'm assuming, is a race. What? Win all goals in roller coaster sprint. Are you serious right now? And the crystal freeway is a sprint, so that's something. But in order for me, me to unlock this, I have to get all goals in roller coaster grand prix. I hate you, you stupid. All right, I'll do that off camera, and we'll do that next time along with the sprint. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like on the video if you did, and I will see you next time for more. Later. <laughs>